You are listening to Apex One Radio. Stay with us for the best bet in the new wave of communication. Apex One Radio. Get informed, enjoy, and learn. First her king was wrong, now to a kingdom come. She's successful and she's thankful. Her past was canceled, received salvation. Been through life's trials and tribulations of pain and the shame, but never resulted to the lane. But gained in the strength just by talking with the man and laying on the saving power of his hand. Hold on. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Our uh, beautiful music by Bernice Blakey, Minister Bernice Blakey. Uh, welcome aboard today on Apex One uh, Snapshot. Uh, today is August 8th, uh, 2017, broadcasting live from Columbus, Ohio. Welcome aboard our listeners uh, in the United States of America, uh, Australia, Germany, Norway, Liberia, the UK, and Cameroon. Uh, today is August 8th. Uh, on Apex Snapshot, we're going to have our, our musical genius, uh, his name is Infectious Michael Dennis. Uh, accompanying her today is Minister Bernice Blakey. Uh, Bernice Blakey, an aspiring, a great aspiring uh, 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 young uh, Liberian musician uh, who have uh, this uh, beautiful single today that's going to be discussed here on Apex One Radio. Again, welcome aboard. Uh, the time is about um, the time is about 5 20 p.m. So listeners, uh, hold on. If you are listening from Australia, from uh, from the UK, uh, Baltimore, Maryland, uh, the show is being monitored by Emily Kamara and uh, and and uh, a good friend of mine. His name is Manix Pay, and then also produced by uh, Ernest Kanjo, CEO, Apex One Radio. Welcome on board.
Beautiful piece of music there by our minister Bernice Blakey. Uh, again, welcome aboard to Apex One Radio. My name is Emmanuel Pei. Uh, broadcasting live on Apex One Snapshot. Uh, if you are listening to us from Australia, from the USA, Germany, Norway, this show is being today monitored by Emily Kamara and Manix Pei. And uh, pr- produced by Ernest Kanjo. Again, my name is Emmanuel Pei. Welcome aboard. Again, to our listeners, uh, this is Apex One Radio Snapshot, uh, broadcasting live from Columbus, Ohio. Today is August 8th, 2017. Uh, the time is about uh, in the studio, we have 5.25 p.m. Today we have uh, the beautiful Golden Voice of Liberia. Her name is Bernie Blackie, and her manager slash producer, a musical genius, infectious Michael Dennis. Hey, I'm Infectious and Bernice. Welcome aboard. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> How's the weather on a Saturday? Uh, I guess it's in the hundreds, but uh, I haven't been out today. Oh, okay. What's up, Bernice? How's, how's your day going so far? It's beautiful. Okay. Very, very beautiful. Like you said, the weather is pretty hot in both ways, but I'm used to it now. <laughs> yeah, no, you know, um, Again, I want to, on behalf of the Apex One Radio team, uh, listening around the world, uh, Cameroon, the UK, Norway, Germany, Australia, and I know like, Liberia is also on board. Again, welcome uh, for your first time, Bernice. I know this is your first time. Uh, uh, Michael, Michael been here before, you know, uh, but this is your first time. Welcome again on, on behalf of the Apex One Radio team. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Again, I uh, will quickly start with uh, Miss Bernice. You know, um, first of all, I know this is your first time on Apex One Radio, so our listeners they are very curious to know uh, they have been listening to your music. You know, since we had the show out for the promotion, but uh, who is Bernie Blackies? Can you just tell a little bit about yourself? Um, in a nutshell, I'm just saying Bernie Blackies is a Liberian artist. Okay. Um, he hails from Bourne County. Okay. And uh, music is basically more focused on the young people than what people do the kind of music kids people use. Okay. And uh, when it's like he started music uh, when he was uh, age 12 and then got involved into music actively when he was 15 years old. Okay. And then won competition, uh, competitions and then by the grace of God, that's when uh, after the competition, that's when I got involved in the happy records, I like Okay. Hmm. Oh, so Michael, do you have any, first of all, uh, again, I know you are currently, uh, the audience will want to know exactly what is your current relationship with, with Bernice. I know one time you mentioned about manager or producer, so how did you guys actually meet? Oh, well, thank you again. Uh, it's a long story, but the car is short, you know. Uh, like she said, you know, uh, 
we all live in Ghana at the time, and then later we moved back. But like I said on this radio before, you know, my whole engineering uh, stuff uh, thing started from Ghana. Okay. You know, so I was in Ghana. You know, we we met each other. We knew each other from there because she was actively involved in singing, especially on uh, this live reality uh, musical program. Okay. Uh, they had one they used to call. They uh, there's a television station there. They used to call uh, TV Three. Yes, yes, yes. And they had this uh, program they used to call TV Three Mentor. Okay. Where yeah, you go live and sing live and stuff like that. So she she was opportune to be a backup vocalist for all the contestants and some uh, guest artists. I was uh, invited for the program to perform. Okay. So she was actively involved and she was singing in church, but. Uh, I have my little studio issues that come there once in a while and then back of uh, artists of um, uh, commercial music. Okay. And we all left and uh, came back to Liberia and uh, it was from Liberia. She's there. She had this competition she was in and she won this competition. Oh. Uh, so sing on to God. Mm-hmm. It was uh, the guy, actually the guy who organized the program is a friend who all uh, lived in Ghana and we, we do the same thing. Okay. You know, so he brought um, her. You know, and said, "Look, um, uh, as a as a prize, you know, we we giving her parcel, and uh, we also uh, uh, she will also do two tracks for you." I said, "Okay, no problem." So when she came, you know, instead of the two I just told, I said, "You know what? Uh, since we've been doing this thing from back home, I mean from back in Ghana, what we're just gonna do?" We're just going to do this thing as a whole album. Let's forget about you just doing two songs and go away. So uh, it was from that moment, you know, uh, our relationship uh, really started. Okay. So since then, she has been with me. I'd be right Yeah, mm-hmm. so that's the history. So she's like uh, mm-hmm. she's like a daughter, a little sister. Okay. And uh, on the business aspect, she's uh, my artist. Okay. And uh, yeah. So Bernice, uh let me let me start with you again. Um I know sometime in, in the in the art of music, uh it takes a special producer, you know, to to I got it to, to convenience or uh, the, the art of a, uh, of a of a of a musician or a singer. And uh, how do you think how do you describe uh Michael Talent? How do you describe his his, his ability to as a producer? I forgot to write. You say how, did, how can I describe it? Yeah, ha, ha, yeah, yes, yes. Ha, ha, I mean, what kind of produ- producer is he? I mean, his skill level. Ah. The worst thing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can call him. <laughs> but I'll just say he's a legend. It's okay. He's one of a kind. Okay. He's somebody that I, I call him a beast. Okay. Yeah, musically, he's a beast. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. He creates, like, out of the. Uh, he got some specific way of producing songs. And the good thing is, he's the kind of person that works along with you very well. Because if you bring a song, you just need to hear the first line. Trust me. <laughs> or in, in fact, even if you don't have a song, he will create a song for you. So okay. That's one. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I say he's a beast and he's a legend. Like <laughs> this, wow. this guy is it's too much. <laughs> <laughs> my God, do you agree? <laughs> Uh, well, uh, I don't blow my own horn. You know, I, I'm a humble, I'm a humble person. Okay. So I, I let uh, people that I work with, and then okay. uh, my brother to speak for me out there. So that's those are the best judges out there, you know. And, and I'm was, I'm was, I mean, I me too because I would do a little bit of research on the whole thing, you know, the preparation for the program and everything. I came across a video where they said that you 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 created a whole bit in five minutes. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> yeah, that, that was last night. <laughs> we, we're not going to talk about it, but you know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> yeah, I okay. know. That yeah. was we were working on something with me. Okay, okay, okay. And then, uh, uh, Miss Bernice, you know, to be honest with you, a lot of our, I mean, my listeners right now and other people I talk to during this process of the program, they really, really kind of like, uh, they are in touch with your voice, your your your, your voice, you know. Because I told them, I said a golden voice, you know. He said, but how can we never heard about 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 uh, we never heard much about uh, her, you know. I say you need to have you need to go back to library music and have more connection with library music because I know that you have a lot of music out there already. So, 
Uh, it, throughout your career, if you can just name some of the, the, the songs you have, you, have, you have produced or you have, you have sung, uh, some of the singles you got, and what are some of your favorite singles? Uh, some of the songs will be the, uh, the first one, let me just say Father's Love, because I know I did crucifixion, but Father's Love was the one that put me on the spotlight. Next to Father's Love was You Not Do It Again. So basically, more people know me for You Not Do It Again. Okay. And then before I feel your pain. But the major one would be Father's Love and You Not Do It Again. Okay, okay. Okay, and then, um, yeah. I know, I know you are now in the U.S., you know, and uh, you guys are working together. Um, and I know you have a single. And we will just talk about a single later on. But let, let's talk about, um, the, the, the art of the music you are a very great singer that's that there is no doubt about that part you know your your talent and your voice uh having the backing of this genius here are you calling the beast you know uh you can do so many things you, you could have choose to be uh, a world musician you know out there with a, like a like a club music whatever why did you choose gospel why not i always whenever somebody asks me that question i say why not that for music you know, I'll give you a little bit of uh, scenario. Like, one time, because I had a lot of people asking me, why is that for music? Why is that for music? So I say, you know what? Let me just try something. I try sitting down one time writing a, a sacred song. Or maybe like, just say a love song for me to record. And and I realized that the way I would, I would sing a gospel song, my voice wouldn't come out. Hmm. If, if you give me a sacred song, I would not, my real stuff would not pop out. Wow. I'm telling you seriously, something I've wow. tried several that's, times, that's, that's and good. It, it won't come. At the, it was from there. I know. I knew that God just wanted me to work for Him, and especially for the young people. That somebody did like you're young. Why are you doing that for music? Hey, when I gave my life to Christ, I didn't have anything to give to Him besides the voice that He gives to me. So I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna give it back to you, Lord. I, I know I'm not a preacher, but at least this this music can do something great. So I'm not. I'm just going to give this back to you. And that's why I chose gospel music, because I love God, because I want to win souls for him, because I want to reach out there to people, and because it's just where I belong. Huh. Wow. Okay, we'll take a quick break here and listen to some of the beautiful music uh, from uh, Minister Bernie, Bernie's uh, Black Key, along with our uh, infectious Michael Dennis. So uh, stay tuned. I will be right back. It's not just another mix, yo. It's reality song. Not an everyday song. Open your heart and listen. Sing it, baby. Let go. I feel your pain. I've seen your shame. I know the struggle and the hearts that you're going to, but it's alright. It's okay. I know you'll be just fine. to you, but it matters to me, but it matters to him, and it matters to she, and those who have cribs living in the dark streets, yeah, every day we hear them calling, but we don't hear them screaming, we all about our cars, cribs and our creaming, living in the dark world, but they screaming, little Pete trying to get up, but he's stuck in the game, and society calls him for minutes, he didn't ask for it, his cars were dealt, man, he didn't pick it, now he's winning the rat race, he can't stop it, yes it is what it is, why you trying to Struggle and the hearts that you're going to, but it's alright. It's okay. I know you'll be just fine. I, 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 I know you'll be just fine. Look at this pretty little thing, an African queen, hoping on the Liberian dream to make cream success. Get married and change your name, but she was caught up in between two parents. Always in the drama like their life was on the screen It seems daddy and mama only pushed and shoved her around 
were never around to show that they loved her. It sounds like she had a different father and mother, doesn't it? But there was another that hovered over her shoulder just to make the cover. In order to show shorty that he loved her, she seemed all alone. While she was growing up on her own, but she was never alone, even though there was nobody home. God was the chaperone and helped her to develop a mind state of her own. So, so in her dome, when I get grown, I'm gonna have a home of my own and a family cornerstone. And then the light shone, like some ice was on. From the darkness, now it's like the lights are on. First her kin was wrong, now to a kingdom come. She's successful, and she's thankful. Her past was canceled, received salvation. Been through life's trials and tribulations. The pain and the shame, but never resulted to the lame. But gained in the strength just by talking with the man. And lame on the saving power of his hand. Hold on, cause that's a better day. For me and you to be in paradise. Yes, I feel you've been a and I know what you're going through, but it's gonna be alright someday. someday. I know you're crying, you're broken inside, cause there's no one for you. you. You hustled every day, you struggled every day, but there's no guy above. Again, welcome back to Beautiful Music by uh, Bernice Blackie, Minister Bernice Blackie, uh, accompanying her today in studio. Apex One Radio Studio is uh, the, her manager. Uh, Infectious Michael Dennis, aka the Beast, uh, and uh, the Musical Genius. Again, welcome back. My name is Emmanuel Pay. Today is August 8, 2017. Uh, broadcasting live from Columbus, Ohio. Uh, the music is entitled "I Feel Your Pain" by uh, Bernice Blackie. Uh, we have uh, some callers online. I mean, I mean, standing by right now. We're gonna bring them through. Uh, we'll just take a quick break to bring them on board. Welcome again, welcome again on Apex One Radio. Um, my name is Emmanuel Pei, hosting today in studio on Apex One Snapshot. Again, I'm um, in studio with me uh, is um, uh, Minister Bernice Blackie, the golden voice of, of, of music in Liberia. And then uh, her manager, uh, 
aka Fetches Michael Dennis, aka the Beast. <laughs> now I gotta get used to that name. So uh, you have a, we have a quarter online. Her name is Emily Kamara, and then uh, along with uh, Fennis Cat. So they got a question for you guys. So you guys are ready? Yeah, I am. Okay. All right, Emily, go ahead. Hi, Ming Sumbergens. Welcome to Ohio. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much for welcoming me. Hello, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, I'm listening now. You, you are live, yeah. Hey there, welcome to Ohio. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you for welcoming me. <laughs> hey, um, I was glad that, to know that you will be here today. So I um, contacted him and I have a few questions for you. I love and enjoy the Liberian Gospel Entertainment, and your work has really, really, really inspired me. Especially, you have done it again, or you are you will do it again. I think you will do it again. You not do it again. You not do it again. You not do it again. Oh God! <laughs> you not do it again. Yes, yes. I love that song. But um, I have one question for you. Um, I know that you are inspired abroad, and um, you have the experience with the business year out of Moravia, Liberia. So my question to you is, since you have these experiences out of Moravia, Liberia, how can you inspire the other, those other musicians who are within the county or the city itself to grow within the gospel music aspect? Well, well, first of all, I have my work. And I work along with them, those that, that want to um, do gospel music. I work along with them, and I help them because most of them look up to me to do music, and I tell them the things that I do as a gospel artist. So basically, I would say my work speaks for me, but I work with them. I have a relationship with them. So whatever they want to do, especially in terms of producing music, some of them, even if they don't know what to produce, I, I direct them. To do people that will be able to help them, but basically I work along with them because if you don't have relationships with these artists that are within uh, the state of the U.S., you won't be able to, you know, share your ideas with them. So first of all, I create a relationship with them and I work along with them and get them connected to people that I can help and help even with the best that I can. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's really good. That's really good because I um, my reason for this question is I believe in unity. And as a gospel artist, if we are united, we will grow more. And um, I was listening to some of your work that you have done. And one of my questions, I'm glad that the host did ask you this question was, why did you choose gospel over, you know, uh, um, I don't want to say street music, but... Uh, secular song, secular song, yeah. Right. Why did you choose that? And I enjoy your question. I enjoy your response because um, if you don't know Christ, it's hard to get it out there. But from your experience and from your answer that I received and I retrieved, I I am humble to say, continue to do the good work, continue to inspire our ears, um, not just gospel, but the words that you use towards your music, the um, the action that you take, and I'm telling you, I really do enjoy that that song that I told you about. <laughs> um, and I I just thank your management for being by your side to encourage you, to inspire to inspire you to inspire us. Wow. Um, I had another question, but I think as the host said, is is based on your uh, new music. Maybe I'll wait till. I don't know. Email you. I, I don't know yeah, if yeah, I should you, wait. You can go. You can go ahead. You can go ahead and ask the questions. We'll, we'll, we'll come okay, back to this. Okay. So later. I listen to level to level. I I listen to the music. Usually I am drawn to music by the beats. I don't know why. Then I get connected to the words. So level to level, I listen to the words, and I just wanted to ask you, what was your specific inspiration to that music? What what inspire you to write that music? Because I enjoy every word for word. Well, it was, two things happened. There was a declaration and also sort of my past, looking at where God took me from, Liberia, and where He brought me. 
to America, and then who he got me involved with, Effectious Mark and Happy Records. So all these things, one step at a time, I believe that he has taken me from one level to another. <laughs> and then I also believe that the scriptures say you don't have to see things before you say it. You have to declare upon your life. So I, I believe in myself that he has taken me to another level. Whether I see it or I don't see it, I already, I already profess it out of my mouth that I've gone to the next level. Whether the devil likes it or not, I'm, I'm already there. So I will, I will, it's, it's also prophetic. Like I was prophesying it for <laughs> myself and also sending it out to people. Wow. From level to level, he has taken you higher. So was that your own word? Was that your own word in music? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I do write my own music, and I also get um, some help with, uh, from my manager. He writes, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that, doesn't make it a beast. <laughs> that, is so, yeah. that is so good. That is so good. Well, that is my question. You bring joy to our ears. Continue to do the good work. So Thank it, you. Is Finney yes, there, too? Okay. Yeah, Finney is here. Finney, do you have any questions she again said, for, 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 for uh, Minister Bernice? She, she said she will call in later. Okay. Okay, again, uh, we want to thank you for calling in, Emily. We got all the callers standing by, so um, you can go out and hang up your phone. Uh, let me talk to her again, uh, Michael. You know, thank you. Yeah, Michael, I know you're yeah. there. I know, like you said, you know, people don't know this, this art of music. I mean, art as a music, you know, it takes just not just a voice, not just, you know, uh, a sound, it takes a skill. To actually make that particular uh, sound and, and the voice together to make it pleasant to the ear. So, if yeah. again, you can just tell us, you know, I mean, what inspired you to, to just keep pushing all the time? And every time you make a beat or every time you make a song, it gets better than the next one. <laughs> oh, well, that's, that's, that's interesting. Well, uh, so first of all, like I always said, uh, my inspiration is firstly from God, and then uh, the gift is also from God. You know, um, uh, the Bible says uh, when a man is given a talent, and uh, he doesn't develop it, and when the person I gave him the talent comes back and is still on the same level, he he's like almost like. Uh, useless to the person. So um, I believe that uh, every gift that God gave men, gave men, you know, is for a purpose. Um, you don't have to see it. You just have to discover yourself and, uh, and, and put it into action. So I, I um, as a, a, a young musician, I, I had an opportunity to be around good Good, good uh, musicians, instrumentalists uh, who, who really knew what they, they did or what 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 they were doing. So they train us in such manner. You know, you can't settle for the less. You can you can't just be like a disciple in your your approach to things. So you you we also though we do this, it's a God given talent and. We, we put it out there to bless the lives of people. But on the secular side, in the Word, uh, it's about uh, also standard, you know. <laughs> so we just try to do what we have to do to meet up with standards, you know, that can match up with other people that on your level or above your level. I know I'm not there yet. I'm still trying. But I have to do what I have to do to present uh, myself uh, and whoever I work with as uh, someone I can be on a level with other people who are already there or close to people who are already there. So that's what I do. What I do, you know, that, that, that's, that's my motivation. Uh, I, I, can't, I can't just settle for the less. I will do more than this. If I can't do it, then I have another philosophy. Those who are above me in what I do or not, to my, not, not on my level who are above my level, then I reach out to them. I, I, can you help me take it up from here? Or what do you think I can do to get it up to this level? So that's my life right there. I can settle for less. Uh, that's the voice of our infectious Michael Dennis, the musical genius. 
from Liberia, the outstanding producer. Elon Sa is the golden voice of Liberian music. Her name is uh, Brandon, Brandon Blackies. Again, uh, we're going to be going to the actual music, the first single, the, 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 the brand new single for Brandon's. Uh, we're going to go ahead and take a quick break. We're going to play that music. Come back. I know there are some, uh, there's, uh, some questions out there for you. I got one from Australia. Who wants to know everywhere? How do you say your music? How, do, how can they get your music and everything like that? They, uh, they're going to stand, they're going to stand by for a minute here. But let me give you a little sound of, uh, level to level. And then when we'll come back. We'll talk about it.
Okay, welcome back, welcome back. Uh, my name is Emmanuel Pei on Apex One uh, Snapshot today, August 8, 2017. Uh, broadcasting live from Columbus, Ohio. Uh, this is the new single. You just listen to the whole to the whole single. We will be discussing that in a minute here, but we have one caller online who want to just say uh, something to uh, Miss Bernie uh, Bernie's. So Bernie's, are you there? Okay, Manix. Okay, you can go ahead. I'm calling from uh, Baltimore, Maryland. Good. Yeah, I'm very, very, very proud of you for what you are bringing to our community. You know, at first thing you've been thinking, I have been one of your followers. I always like, so I'm a DJ here. Uh, on the east coast so most of the time and with we'll my setting coming from Bone County I'm always playing those gospel music whenever we're having our our better occasion and things like that and it, so the people will love it so <laughs> I am very very proud of you all I can tell you is continue to do the good work and we always you know try to support you I things progress with you. So I just want to say thank you again and continue the good work. Amen. We bless God and thank you for, for your support and keep me in prayers too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um again, Bernice, I know I know we, we, we had just let the cat out of the bed right now. So people we don't have the time to have address all the questions through our um um What's up? But um, we're going to go to level to level, okay? So <laughs> that's going to be the discussion for now. There's a line in that in 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 song. You rise in above all things. Okay? I mean, like, like uh, Emily earlier said earlier, you know, this particular song, I wish, I wish, I mean, we're going to try to make sure that people listen to the song. You know, a lot of people listen to the song because... If you listen to the song, even the first line is, is a gospel by itself, you know. So those who are listening, like I said, I got a lot of questions coming in. We cannot address everything. Well, I will, will pick some few just to go over that with you. But are you a preacher? Can you really preach? Besides just singing, can you preach? Let me laugh. Well, once you a gospel artist... It's a preacher in the form that okay. minister to music. Okay. And trust me, when I I'm the kind of uh, singer that when I get on stage, it just come out. Okay. When I'm, when I, it's, not, it's not like I said, it's not about me. So when I'm when I'm on stage or when I'm once I'm doing my music or I'm ministering to people, mm-hmm. that preaching side of me pop out. But okay. I'm not a preacher like I go to the church and say I'm a pastor. No. I know. I'm a singer. I do gospel music. I preach to my music. I give hope to people. To my music, but when when I, that PC side when it come out when I am actually on stage ministering that that's when you want to that, that's when you you see it you come it out. <laughs> I mean I know what I'm saying. I mean I, I didn't mean the word to come because the reason I'm just asking this question is that Michael, I know you can hear me. You know, yeah, uh, if you have a gift, and we talk about even even in school or whatever, if this person is just a genius, this person is just smart. Their art began effortless. You know what I mean? So if, like, uh, a friend of mine contacted me from Australia, you know, he, he just, I told you, I mean, like, 30 minutes ago on my way here, he said, I said, just listen to this song. And then he went ahead, he listened to the song. And then he told me that, like, you know, it almost like he's in a church. But then what I'm saying is that, well, her skill, well, her skill, you know, what is a goal for you guys? I mean, going forward, what what is what are you guys working on? What is the plan you guys got go working forward? Because people gonna love this this girl. People gonna I mean, crave for her already happening. I'm not gonna you know it already happening. But I know the marketing part. We'll, we'll talk about it later on. But um, let's talk about some of the plan you guys got together. Are you gonna make an EP like an album? Are you gonna do something like people can people can go and buy besides going on YouTube, maybe getting a single or whatever? Do you have any other plan together? Um, yeah, um, currently we, uh, we are working on a series of songs okay. and, uh, we're going to be doing, uh, a, a launch. 
Okay. Uh, those uh, songs. That's a steady launch uh, okay. video. Also, okay. uh, next year we hope in uh, uh, the probably the first quarter of the year. Okay. Or in the second quarter of the year. But we're hoping to do it the first quarter of the year next year. That's twenty eighteen. Okay. That's what we're working on. So yes, we have uh, a lot of plans. But right now, what we're doing. You know she's been uh, out of the system for a little over three years now. So uh, as a way of you know uh, uh, reminding people that oh you, you, you people don't forget about uh, this first this first being around and uh, this is what they're doing and they're coming back again. So that's our way of uh, in the next few months we'll be really re- releasing uh, a few other songs and then. Uh, of videos okay. uh, we're working on videos in fact this week uh, we had uh, video shoots okay. and we already have uh, one video that uh, we're going to be putting out uh, hopefully uh, before the month end um, so we yeah uh, we got we got we are working on tours you know because you can have the music and then get with the music people that what I'm saying yeah yeah want to have you close to them they want to know you they want to experience uh, your presence you know um, uh, in, in a worship uh, 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 seminar or in, in some uh, uh, church or whatsoever. So those are the things we're working on and uh, we are open up to people around the world, um, uh, wherever you are, in Africa, um, Asia, Europe, Australia. We are open up, you know, um, you can get to this radio station and if you want us to come uh, to where you are, um, we are available, we are willing. So those are things that we're working on. We already okay. talked to a few people who uh, 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 are willing to invite us over for programs in other countries. So, okay. uh, and we are doing our, our background work well. So yeah, we, we got plans and uh, uh, we, we it's just one step at a time because right now, uh, we try to handle everything by ourselves no. um, here, and uh, you know, as young people, uh, when you people uh, haven't accomplished much here, you know, you 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 take your time and you take it one step at a time, okay. and if God is going to send somewhere along your way, you say, okay, uh, uh, where well, you guys can reach, uh, we we gonna check it up from there, or let us let us just join forces and make this thing work, you know. So we are taking it one step at a time, and uh, we, we, we're not doing uh, uh, something physical here, it's also spiritual, so we're also looking um, at the direction of God to the way He's going to take us, how He's going to lead us, you know, into the right people, and to the right connections and stuff like that. Um, that's why we're looking up. So yeah, we got plans, and uh, in due time, full time, we're going to see things that uh, we've been planning and uh, we, we're doing, yeah. Okay, and, and then uh, the next one, I know the reason why I said, but especially with the CDs, you know, like you said, always uh, all the gospel concerts that people been told that they told me, they will go there and after they started the concert, they buy the CDs. And I know technology is taking over the world right now, but we still have a lot of other people who are old school, like some of the parents who want to buy the actual CDs, you know what I mean? So that's why sometimes, that was, that's why I brought that topic, I mean, that question out there so that, you know, because some people, yeah, not everybody yeah. can go to iTunes to, like, my, my mother yeah. might not be able to do in that. Fact, so, I was, um, I was, yeah, in fact, I was in church yesterday and she, she led worship yesterday. Okay. And after service, you know, before, I was running the teleprompter song. I place it on the board that those who want uh, the Severn is like a new song. You can go online, the online stores like Amazon, uh, iTunes, and all over the place, you know, it's in every record store, music store. And I, <laughs> so the pastor already announced him from the teleprompter, encouraged people. But then he also said, that, well, the way some of us, we are old school. Okay. <laughs> we, we, we don't have this. So yep. I'm gonna get it. Can you make our CDs available? Yep. But yeah, we're not gonna. Their time is gonna come. Uh, okay. That's where we're gonna have the program. That's a physical program. Okay. And then people can go there and purchase CD. Uh, or after the CD has been launched, when she go to your church to minister, she's gonna get CDs available. And so we're gonna be like we're gonna be exploring all over the place. Uh, CDs physically. And then uh, go on the internet, and then buy also. So we're, we're gonna get it all the way out there. That's what we're working on. Yeah. Hmm. 
All right, uh, Miss Blackie, I have our, um, a message or questions here from our, the name is Ivan. He's from Australia. Ivan wants to know, <laughs> first he wants to know how many, how many music do you listen to? And then uh, he also wants to know, like, uh, with this single here, do you have any other thing that you're working on right now with, with, uh, with your manager? Like a tour. I know I know. Uh, uh, Michael have already addressed the tour thing, but any other plan for a tour? Like oh. how, you know, can they contact you guys is just in case uh, and all the stuff like that? Oh, you mean, if, if I got you right, he wants to know how he can contact me? Yeah, first he, wanted, first he wanted to know how many music do you listen to? He also wants to know uh, like, I listen to a lot of music. I listen to pirates of music. Okay. I don't sing it myself okay. because if you want to be a great person, you have to not. You have to listen to a lot of things. Even though I have my own style of music, yeah. but I listen to other mu- musicians to help me grow. So I, yes, I don't limit myself. I listen to a lot. And um, if you want to reach out to me, I'm right on Facebook. My manager is also on Facebook. I'm easier to be reached out. You can just maybe send me your number, and I'll just give to my manager, and then we can start from there. Or you can go on his page, find me at records or Fetchers Michael, and you can just, in fact, just get straight to him. Okay, I know. I know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yes, 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 Online uh, music, online uh, link, the, the people can go to yeah. People can go to it. They want to, you know. Uh, uh, we have it on uh, Amazon. Like okay. most of our people who live in advanced country, they, okay. they use money, card, you yes. know, bank card to mm-hmm. other stuff, mm-hmm. debit card, credit card. Mm-hmm. So you can go on a- Amazon mm-hmm. and you type in the search column. You type in Bernice Blackie okay. music, and it's, our music is going to pop up. If you have Amazon download. For those who are using Android phones, okay. you can download the music there. It's just uh, $1. Uh, okay. There, it's just a dollar. And you go to iTunes, those who deal with uh, Apple products, mm-hmm. you, you you got an iPhone, you can go to the iTunes store, yeah. and you type in Bernice Blackie, and her music is going to be there. You can also buy it for $0.99. Cent. Okay. You go to CD Baby, you do the same thing, just type in the name. You don't have to type in the song. You just type in the name. Okay. And it's going to pop up. Amazon, uh, it's on Spotify, it's on uh, Pandora, it's every music store, every distribution store. So if you have a kind of store in your country that is also sell music, you want to give it a try, you know, because okay. uh, the way we set it up, uh, um, CD Baby has to distribute that music to every music store huh. in the world. So it is everywhere. So there's no excuse, you know, and stuff like that. So it's everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, that was uh, the voice. That's the voice of uh, the Beast, aka Musical Genius. Uh, alongside him is uh, our golden voice of the Liberian music, especially the gospel music. Her name is uh, Bernice Blackie. Uh, she have this beautiful, beautiful new single out called Level to Level. If you haven't heard this music. You might want to start right now going going to YouTube. Uh, he already have given you every link. Amazon, uh, go to Amazon. You know, search uh, Bernie Black Keys. Go to iTunes. Go to the Apple Store or the App Store and, and search for a uh, uh, Bernie Black Key. A uh, uh, Black Key. Go to uh, CD Baby, Spotify. If you are listening to me from uh, uh, Liberia right now. Um, you can also do that, especially Spotify, most popular in Liberia, as I know of. Um, again, uh, my listeners in Australia, Germany, Norway, um, you are listening to our uh, Apex Snapshot today uh, in Columbus, Ohio, broadcasting live uh, from from the, the the city of Columbus. And then, uh, like I said, we have this uh, beautiful, beautiful music from our, 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 our great, great artist. I know one thing I must say here on the record is that... Um, we Liberian, we always want people to give us, I mean, or we want to pray somebody when they are not around us, you know. We learned this, we learned this recently with some of our brother who uh, passed, you know, uh, we're never going to forget him. But why not embrace this talent? Why not, you know, uh, support this, this, this gift? We're all going to benefit. It's Liberia. 
is represent Liberia and African music in general. This gospel music is not just for a Liberian, uh, 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 how you call it, a Liberian, uh, how you call it, uh, uh, setting. This gospel music is for the entire world, the entire Africa, the continent of Africa. So it will be a great, great, uh, you know, joy to see this beautiful, beautiful gift, you know, uh, spread out around the world. So we'll take a quick break again, you know, we're coming back for a closure. I know we're running out of time right now. So again, uh, if you can hold on for a little bit, uh, 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 Ms. Ms. Black here and, uh, and, and Michael, we'll be right back. That I would be like this. Oh, you brought joy in my life. You put smile on my face. That's who you are. That's who you are. Lord, you change my story. That's who you are, that's who you are, that's who you are. Lord, you change my story. Oh, it is for your glory. That's who you are, that's who you are, that's who you are to me. That's who you are. That's who you are. Oh my God! Uh, like somebody just uh, texted me. The person said, uh, "Why? Why would they have a show on Sunday? Because <laughs> uh, they feel that they are in church already." So, so, uh, Minister Blackie, I know we're about to close. So, um, again, uh, on behalf of the Apex One Radio team, we want to uh, greet you with pleasure and welcome you today for taking your uh, basic time off to just bless us. You know, bless our hearts. You know. Um, to all my listeners around the world, thank you for joining me. Before we close, so do you have any last word out there for the audience today? Um, I want to say thanks to everyone for their support and prayer. And please keep us in your prayers again because the music, the musical journey is not an easy thing. <laughs> it's not an easy thing. You need support. So if you're out there... Trust me, we're not too deep to still be. You can't expect support. We take support for everything. You're fighting, you're tension, it's needed because we need a trip video, we need a hot squad, and we need your support. So if you, if you want to sponsor us, you can reach you can reach out to my manager, Session Smart, or even Freddie Emmanuel. Yes. I mean, you can reach out to him and then you will get to us. Okay. I mean, to, to sponsor us anyway. And um, just watch out because this is just the beginning for us to have the record family. We're just getting started. There's a lot of more things that we're going to do uh, uh, we're working towards so keep us in your prayers and thanks for your support like he said the songs are out there I mean not only um, Level to Level I have other songs there too so just go on iTunes Spotify Amazon and get this song out share the people and share the message but once again thanks for your support before you go uh, oh he just, just hang up um, we had another call on, on the line but um Again, uh, Michael, I want to yes. say I want to say thank you. I mean, like I know, <laughs> I feel like I've been knowing you guys forever, even though we just talk once in a while on the phone. But uh, I'm a Liberian, I'm an African, I'm a human. Uh, in this, in this, in this job, just as you say, you know, uh, we don't we don't make much, but the fact that you recognize and embrace a blessing. I don't want to say talent, but a blessing. You know, and you are the one have been one of the the greatest. Uh, 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 instrumental uh, producer out there, and I just want to say to you, you know, as a brother, you know, thank you. 
But uh, again, we want to open a little bit of uh, a little bit session here. If if Miss Bernie can just hold on for a little bit, just stay with us for a little bit. Michael, can you just tell us again? Um, I know you have another thing on the side. I don't want to go like you know talking about Miss Bernie today, but you also have this foundation for Quincy B. Briefly, just briefly oh, yeah. oh, talk yeah. about it, and then uh, we can close again. I we got like the ten more minutes left, so we can close together. You know, if we get our quarter back again, maybe the quarter want to ask our Miss Bernie that she can answer the question. But you go ahead, tell us a little uh, bit about this uh, uh, this uh, 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 website that's out there you. and everything. Once again, I want to say thank you so much to the Apex One Radio family. You guys got my back, and I appreciate it so much. Uh, the Quincy B Foundation has already started. Even this morning, uh, I I posted on his page, uh, on on his foundation page. Um, we found this land in in Monrovia, and we're trying to purchase it because okay. what we want to do, want to want to set a structure there where we can. Uh, um, bring the young kids, educate them, provide them with uh, uh, some educational material and find some of our sites to start teaching them uh, 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 basic education and also uh, music because that was part of his life. So we cannot leave it out, you know, we cannot really leave that out. That was part of his life. So uh, we're attached to music because if we engage children energy positively, they they're gonna they're gonna um, exhibit positive energy out, outside there too, you know, um, especially in a society where you know uh, you got a lot of some of the way work kids, you know, just for that worker, but yeah, we got a lot of kids who oh, have yeah. no direction. Some of them don't have family that really caring for them. So yeah, that's why uh, that's why the foundation. So if you watch this. Uh, music, the other music video called Check, uh, Check and Balance. Mm-hmm. That was something that was from his heart. When I was listening, these are things we used to talk about. These were things that, you know, so, and in the video, he identified with people. Besides his real life, he always wanted to help people. Like I said, when I gave him $100 today, if I did a job and he, and we we'll to get him $100 today, and the next woman I tell you to give him that $100, I have to give it to his friend. With no frown on his face, with no disappointment, regret, he would take that money and give it back to me. So that's the kind of soul, you know, he had. So we we want that thing to continue. He might not be around tomorrow. We want that legacy. When I say legacy, it's something that something that somebody believing and they die for, and they live for, they die for. So that thing should continue. You know, yeah, it should okay, continue. So, you know? so, so what, yeah, right now uh-huh. that. Again, yeah, what is right. what is the That's website? What yeah, the website. I, I know. The website is uh, uh, yeah. Uh, you know, normally, normally these days, when I really go about WWW and stuff like that. But yeah, you can still go www dot twenty foundation dot org, or you can uh, just type in http uh, column and then uh, uh, two strokes with uh, twenty b foundation dot org. So you go on our website. You're gonna read everything about Quincy. You're gonna read every information you need, and then you go. You can go into the donation section, and then uh, uh, you donate whatsoever dollar. If if you have hundred thousand person donating just a dollar yeah. or fifty cents, yes. that would be a lot. You know, if I have you ten thousand person donating just a dollar, that would be a lot. You know. So yeah, basically, yeah. So we're working. So we're hopefully. We're looking at September to be able to show all this piece of land that we're trying to buy. It's okay. about uh, it's like an acre, acre of land. Okay. So we're trying to buy that land and then clean, clear it, and then start doing some investment on the land to, to start some major projects. Hmm. Okay, and, and then uh, uh, like I like you say, you know, Quincy B. I know some of you guys are listening to me right now on Apex One today. I remember vividly when this when this young talent was lost. We have people using his picture on Facebook as their 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 how you call it? Uh, their status status picture. You know, people giving words out there. This foundation is not ready. The foundation is ready, so there's no excuse. You know, to hold back. Like he said, you don't have to pay one thousand dollars. You can pay a uh, fifty cent. You can pay a dollar. Whatever you get. Go to www.quincybfoundation.com and then also uh, org, 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 org,
or you can contact him on Facebook, Infectious Michael Dennis. You can you can search his name, you're gonna find him, contact him, inbox him, whatever it is, you know. You can go ahead and support this goal. Because I know, like you say, you know, it's not always a good thing that we pray somebody when we don't when we cannot see the person anymore. It's always a good thing to give the person their flower while they are alive. Yes, it happened. But now what can we do? A legacy stays behind. So uh, again, if you listen to me, that he, he clearly said to you, go again to www.quincybfoundation.org and then uh, and donate. Okay, so take a quick break again. Apex One Radio USA. Apex One Radio. The best in animation. Again, welcome back, welcome back. Sorry for the, uh, we had a little technical difficulties here in the studio. But we are back uh, to close, officially close the show today. Um, again, to my listeners, thanks for your patience. I can see all the, the everybody coming on board now. Um, again, uh, we were speaking to uh, Ms. Bernice Blackie and the fetches Michael Dennis. Uh, like I said, Liberian, Liberian, uh, African all around the world. Um, let us support each other, you know. That's what I can tell you right now. Let us support each other. And I will make sure that I uh, keep in touch with this particular group <laughs> of talent here. Uh, 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 Mr. Dennis and, uh, and Ms. Ms. Blackie. Again, uh, we are we are at the closure now. So before we close, I will again give you guys, Michael, you'll be the first to just give her the last word. And we're going to go to Ms. Bernice. She can close. With the love the Apex Radio has shown us, especially when it comes to uh, promoting Liberian uh, music and the artists. So yeah, um, on behalf of Hadby Records and uh, my artist Bernie Blackie, I want to tell everybody out there, thank you. Please support us. Uh, we need all the support we can have to be able to fulfill our, our, our purpose and our destiny. So we want to thank you again and uh, thank Apex One Radio. Okay. And then Miss Bernie, your last word. Okay, before I go, I want to do this. From level to level, hey, I, I'm a winner, hey. <laughs> I want to say thank you guys so much for your support wow. and thanks to everyone. Please, 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 if you want to support us, like I said, reach out to Barimano or you can reach out to my manager and yep. whatever. We will appreciate it. Keep us okay. in your prowls and watch okay. out for more songs and more music videos. Hmm. Okay, again, I want to thank all my listeners around the world. I have uh, We have listeners from... Liberia, we have listeners from Australia, Germany, Norway, the UK, and Cameroon. Uh, because uh, Apex One Radio is a family business uh, from our Cameroon, Nigeria, Liberia combined together. We all want to promote our African talent around the world. So, again, my name is Emmanuel Pei. The show was uh, uh, hosted by Emmanuel Pei, produced by uh, Ernest Kanjo, CEO for Apex One Radio. Again, it was monitored by uh, Emily Kamara. And Manix Pay. Bye for now. You have a wonderful day. I'm
to pass. 